Hello everyone, welcome back to my tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to solve a bar element of length 1 meter and cross section is 0.1 meter and 0.1 meter. Our material is steel as angst modulus of 210 gigapascal and poison ratio is 0.3. We are going to do linear static analysis. So here is the graphical picture. Of, we are going to use a bar element of length 1 meter and cross sectional area is 0.1 and 0.1 meter. So here we are going to apply a tensile load of 1000 newton. Same thing we are going to analyze using codaster. So this is the output, this is the displacement plot and this is the reaction force and the final one is this is normal stresses. Now we will solve the problem in Codaster. Now just go to location where you are saved. I have saved here. Open Salamaka. Please subscribe my channel for more videos. Now just go to geometry. Now I just want to create here you can see I just want to create a uh, just line of 1 meter for that just create two points go to new entity basic point so yes just apply it it has created first point the next point in next direction one apply and close there is two vertex we have created this is we can see in third one here you can see xy plane here there is one more point and one more here now we just want to create line using basic option of line so it has chosen the vertex 2 and we just want to choose the vertex 1 apply and close now you can see we have created the line now we just want to create a group for applying the boundary conditions so this is bar apply this line is a bar then I just want to apply a fixed bound condition at the left side this is fix fix node fix underscore node this is I'm naming it load underscore node And apply in plus now we have created the boundary conditions now we will save this file save I'm doing in pictures just go to pictures code aster actually loaded part here I'm saving it. so after saving a file just go to mesh now we have done our geometry model then we just want to go for mesh so select this line one this is our geometry go to mesh create mesh now choose wire discretization algorithm and hypothesis you choose as a local length it will defaultly it will show point one just keep this point one then ok apply and close now right click this mesh one and compute now you can see there are 10 edges 11 nodes this is our mesh information just close it so this is the line we have divided this line into 10 number of elements and 11 number of nodes now to check this go to add add node you can see this is the way node has created okay now if you want to see the numbers in the nodes just right click here go for numbering display nodes just click once again you can see the nodes numbered 1 this is 1 actually this is 2 and 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 this is the way it has numbered if you have started with this means 1 2 then it will be numbered 3 4 5 6 
so the first point i have taken to create a line is this point that's why it has numbered from here okay so now go to mesh one this is a uh, two node groups we want to apply boundary conditions that is we have taken it to the mesh then edges this is a bar element so we just want to apply uh, we are just simplifying the 3d model into a 1d model for that uh, we just want to apply a cra cross section so we'll be applying cross section to this bar element now we have done our meshing um, save this file Control s or click here now we just want to generate the command file uh, we can generate the command file in code aster by manually instant we can go for wizard some moon is engineering which is they have created a wizard for this so the efficient is the uh, wizard to generate the command file for uh, static analysis and uh, static analysis and static nonlinear analysis for code aster so i just opening this moon is engineering open with application open jdk java 8 runtime select this one now this is the efficient wizard for generate the command file for code aster so this is a efficient software okay so now mesh type is a medium only now just go to analysis type this model is not a 3d this is actually a simplified model of 1d from the 3d so mechanical beam element go to material so our material is uh, here there is a database which has minimum type of material properties but uh, here our material is steel material name young small is 210 gigapascal that means 210 into e power 9 then poisson ratio is point you can check with this here here I have mentioned 0.3 same you just mentioned it 0.3 and steel density is 7860 now assign to bar you can specify it as a hall also the both are same now I have created a group that's why I have applied to the bar then add it here then go to element type this is a beam element choose beam here there are different type of cross sections are there ours is a rectangle cross section assigned to bar there is no thickness for width is 0.1 meter and horizontal height is 0.1 meter now just add it now go to boundary condition here ours is a nodal group here we just want to do a fixed boundary condition assigned to a group name is fix underscore node go here enter fix underscore node assigned to all so i have fixed all the degree of freedoms because a beam element it has six degree of freedom then add then again go to loads here we are we need to apply a load a force on node load name is just load assigned to a boundary group is load underscore node load underscore node i just want to pull it in the x direction you can check here this is the x axis so i just want to pull it on the x direction so it's a positive value of thousand remaining you keep it empty and add now i just go to outputs now we just want to add the all the outputs just add all save the command file now go to chess code aster axially load our beam element i'm saving as a static dot comm command file just save it so writing of command file is complete just ok 
just exit now we have generated the command file now we have generated the mesh also so just export this mesh export MED same location you just saved now mesh also we have done after that we just want to solve by using mesh file and command file for that just go to tools plugins here option is called as code aster in that run ASTK we'll be using ASTK to run the case so this is our ASTK file just go to here go to pictures code aster actually loaded bar then ok then files first input files command file mesh file mesh means it has defined it as a mail these two are input files then output files message file resu result file error file then output for post processing that is just make it up Res rmd that is the output file this is coming under 80 now command means input this, that is input code then mail means mesh file then message result error and rmd is the output file these these files are these, three, these four are output files okay we just want to define now just keep it aside this also keep it in this side now just name it one by one just i'm just go to pictures code aster actually loaded bar now so first one is static static dot .com. the second file is mesh mesh underscore one dot med this thing we just want to name it ourselves message dot mess resu dot ruhu error error dot err then result we can take uh, name it as static underscore result dot rmed so this way it will generate so now here we can use memory how much memory we want to use in from our ram so i just 2 gb i just want to use time we can specify it. 15 minutes is much more time for this simple problem i'm just keeping this time then tick this interactive fall off tick this then we just want to run it press capital run okay so i just running it just have a look so before running it it asked me to save the file just save astk now you can see this has saved here now it start started running so now you can check with the message file if any error comes you can see it our results file are generated that means there is no error otherwise you can check it here also so this is our message file here you can see diagnosis job is ok there is no message also so this is our message file just close it now we can open this static underscore result dot rmd into paraways to view the results now just go to salomeca go to paraways just right click this building and go to Vanguard pictures okay now we can see it there are different results are came here applied this is our view now we just go to here displacement this is our displacement magnitude then to view the uh, stress this is our stress we have applied a force of 1000 newton the cross sectional area is uh, 0.1 and 0.1 so the stress coming a normal stress coming 1e per 5 
the same only so 1e power 5 so uh, reaction force means this is reaction force this is reaction force in x direction you can see it here the minus 1000 is the reaction force at the fixed location the remaining location reaction is 0 because there is no thing so to change the color here it can go rainbow apply ok and close so as of now we have completed a solving a simplified a model of 3d model by using a beam element thank you for watching my videos please subscribe my channel for more videos